Thank you so much for coming out today. We are making history, and you know, six weeks ago, seven weeks ago, I don't think that anyone would have thought that something like this would come together. Roll out the recall, Levick is on the run. Roll out the recall, sing out a song of cheer. Now's the time to recall my leg for the game's all here. I never expected to spend so many hours in Madison marching around our state capitol, but I don't regret a single moment. The time has come for us to take back our district and to put it in the hands of someone who works for the best interest of all of us, not just a privileged few. These last few weeks have been emotional for all of us, and this past week's Supreme Court race has been a roller coaster. But we cannot give up the fight. We create democracy by practicing it. And that is what you are doing here today. In our democracy. I worked on the negotiating team when Scott Walker was the county exec. And I can tell you that Scott Walker does not like unions. Scott Walker does not like unions because Scott Walker does not know how to negotiate. Scott Walker only knows how to dictate. Yeah. Mary Lassage voted for this bill. Lassage voted for this bill. And so our job is clear. We need to make the senators accountable for their vote. So we need to recall Mary Lassage. This is what democracy looks like. This is what democracy looks like. Give a round, loud, loud round of applause for Senator Tim Carpenter. Thanks for all of you turning out. I know it's not the best day. Tomorrow it's going to be 80 degrees today. It's a little bit cool, but uh, I'm welcome to be in Republican uh, Waukesha, New Berlin. Uh, I just talked to the Waukesha County Clerk, and she estimates there are 7,000 people here today. So the Republicans aren't very good with the math, and they aren't very good with the people. I wanted to let you know I've served with Mary Lazic for many years. I've been in the legislature for 27 years and in the Senate uh, since 2003, and so I know Mary Lazic. And it's funny, the Republicans were complaining that we were standing up for workers' rights. The only way we could stop the Republicans and the Koch brothers is to stand up and do the only thing that we could according to the Senate rules that the Republicans adopted. And we did that. We slowed the train down. And because, because that train was slowed down, we have that... Nixon, Richard Nixon tape of Walker talking with the Koch brothers, telling us what type of governor he is. Now, he must have gone to the governor, uh, Blagdogovich, Illinois Governor School of, of, uh, of Governing, because, well, they both have bad hairstyles. And in my mind, they don't represent or don't rep didn't represent their constituents. What I'm here to say, we were gone for a couple weeks. We came back on March 12th, and it was great to see all of these rallies in Madison, all over the country, all over Wisconsin. You are making a difference. People across the world and across the country are seeing Wisconsin on the news. It seems like Scott Walker started in office six weeks, promised to create jobs, gave $140 million to corporations, didn't create a single job. And that's why independents and Republicans from areas like this in New Berlin are upset. Yeah. And it's too bad that Senator Mary Lozick couldn't have the guts to stand up to Governor Walker like Senator Schultz did for yeah. White House. Yeah. 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 Yeah.